Making our bead of hope, we'll choose a triangular hand-colored piece of paper, and inside the bead, I'm going to write a message for hope and healing. Now we're just going to take our little stick. It's nothing more than a uh, skewer that you can buy in the supermarket. And we're going to begin rolling the paper onto the stick, not using any glue as you begin to roll. And you'll want to make one good full roll without glue so you can remove the stick. You don't want to glue the stick to the paper. At this point, I'm going to take my glue stick and we're going to glue the remaining part of the paper all the way down to the very tip. You can use Elmer's glue. There you go. Now we'll proceed by just rolling the paper very slowly and intentionally, keeping the bead centered, or the paper centered, and getting it as tight as you can so that you have an equal amount of paper on both sides, and continue rolling all the way down to the tip. Sometimes it's helpful to reinforce that very end with a little more glue. And there you have your bead of hope. Each one is individual. Colors vary depending upon the colors you choose to paint your paper. And then it's very easy to string your bead and wear it at your wrist as a lovely support system for hope and healing.